What's up you guys, it's Ken and welcome to another video. Yes, for today's video I am wearing my glasses. I didn't feel like taking my glasses off because I actually want to see myself in the screen. And yeah, the reflection of my windows are reflecting my eyes, but whatever. I hope you guys can like appreciate it. Today I have a really cool video. I have another haul. I'm really excited to show you guys the things that I have. The new things that I bought actually yesterday, some of the things and other things I bought in like last week. But yeah, I'm really, really excited to show you guys. I think this is my favorite haul that I've ever done. Like the pieces that I bought are, I'm loving it. And it is mostly a clothing haul. So before showing you guys the new things that I bought, I want you guys to please subscribe to my channel. The link is right here. You can press that and you will be subscribed. That will let you guys know when I upload a new video. Also, if you want to follow me in Instagram and Twitter, here are my handles and the rest of my social media links are down below in the description box. And also, if you want to thumbs up the video right now, you can also do that. And without further ado, let's get into the haul. So this haul is mostly a clothing haul, there's only one object that is not a clothing item. What I love about this haul is that most of the clo most of the things that I bought are from stores that I've never bought there before because these stores are new stores here in Puerto Rico and as you guys know I live here in Puerto Rico not in the US. I bought from H&M, Anthropology and Hollister which are stores that weren't here in Puerto Rico and now they're here and the other stores that I bought are from a local shoe store and uh, Marshalls. Let's start with H&M. This time I actually have the bag because like I said before, most of these things I bought them yesterday. So I kept them in the bag just to show you guys. So the first thing that I bought is this shirt. And it's just a gray, a light gray with black stripes shirt. And it was really, really economical. It was only $7.99, just uh, like $8. And yeah, I tried them on and this one, I loved it, how it fit on me. It wasn't too big, it wasn't too small. It was perfect and it is a small. And I don't really like to buy medium things, like medium size shirts because I like them to be a little bit fitted on me. I don't want things to be like really big on me and I'm really skinny so that's why I buy them small or even maybe sometimes extra small. But yeah, this shirt, I am really liking it. I am in love with it. Mostly I went shopping because I was looking for a shirt to wear to Vlogging Fest. If you guys don't know what Vlogging Fest, here is the little picture of me going to Vlogging Fest. Um, anyway, I was shopping especially for that and I bought like way more than I should have. The other shirt that I bought from H&M is this shirt that says Future of 1993. I thought that it was really cool, something that I've never had in my closet and it's just this like navy blue really dark blue um color and just a white little text on the front and this one was $12.99 I think it came out a little less than that if I'm not I do find that the other one that the first one that I showed you guys fits me better but I really like this one either way the last thing that I bought at H&M is this belt, which I was really in, in need of a belt. Here you guys can see it completely. So I bought this belt and actually this was the most expensive thing that I bought yesterday at the mall. And it just came out in $17.99. You guys cannot see those numbers, I think. It's like focusing on the Polaroids in the back. Anyway, <laughs> I really needed a belt, a new belt. And this is just a casual belt like to wear with jeans, like anywhere not like really not like for a classy fancy event just like to go anywhere I have a lot of jeans that fits me, that fit me a little bigger um, I have a really small waist but now I have this belt to solve my problems and I really like it because it's brown it's like leathery really really like it if you guys don't have one of these I recommend it because it gives a certain touch to your outfit so at Hollister, I have this really small bag. I just bought two shirts and I really didn't picture myself buying anything at Hollister. I had never shopped at Hollister. It looks just like Abercrombie and I just thought that it was going to be really expensive and like not in my budget range. 
but when I went in there and started to see the prices like oh my god I almost died like now it's one of my favorite stores so let me show you guys the things that I bought so first I bought this shirt and I really like the color I've never bought a mustard colored shirt so I really am into this shirt and this is a size medium they didn't have a size small I was kind of disappointed in that but I bought it anyway because I really really like it and I think this one's gonna be the one that I'm gonna wear to vlogging fest don't know anyway this was it came out in $12 so it came out in $12 both of them which the price I have to say is amazing and I really like that shirt. I also bought this shirt, which I kind of like, not more, but like the same as that one. And it's this one, and it says Hollister. I really like this one. I'm either gonna wear that one, the mustard one, to Vlogging Fest, or this one. I'm not really sure. I really like them both so much. And they're really different, really like it. And this was, the original price was, $17 but it came out in $12 because I did not know this that they had a sale going on that all of their shirts were $12 so I was really excited about that I was just gonna buy this one but then when he said that it was $12 I said no I'm gonna go back and get the other one so this shirt I originally bought it for vlogging fest I bought it at online and I designed it myself but I really don't like how it came out and it's just a long sleeve t-shirt and it has my name there with my new logo kind of thing, font. And yeah, I don't really like how it came out. I, I wanted it, the letters to be bigger and more a little bit more down. So I really don't know if I'm going to wear it to vlogging stuff because I was a little bit disappointed and it was really expensive. This came out in $30 for just adding this. So the next item that I have is another t-shirt. And I think that you guys saw me with this one already in the vlog. And I bought it a couple of weeks ago, but I've only worn it two times. I actually wore it yesterday to the mall. And it's this t-shirt that I bought at Marshalls. And it just says California. It has the, it has the California bear um, flag thing. I think I already talked about this shirt in another video. I think it was in my past video. Anyway, it's already in this video. Just gonna keep it in. And I bought it at Marshalls, it was like $6. So surprisingly, the next thing is not a t-shirt because I only been showing you guys the t-shirts. The next thing is shoes. Let me get them. These are my new shoes that I bought at a local shoe store. And get this guys, the price of these babies was only $15 for only this. Like. Are you kidding me? These shoes are really cool. They're awesome. They're like, they're really stylish shoes. I can't wait to wear them. I haven't worn them yet, but I am loving them so much. And just $15, guys. Like, this looks a shoe that you would buy at Aldo, like, for, like, $80. And I got them for $15 at a local shoe store. And the last thing that I'll be showing you guys is the thing that I bought at Anthropology. I just need to be honest with you guys. I am in love with that store. I had never shopped there before. Like I said before, these stores weren't here in Puerto Rico and now they're here in Puerto Rico. And I'm very excited, very grateful that they built that really big mall over there in the capital all the way in San Juan. And like, I'm so happy that they have these stores because I'm in love with them. And they're gonna open now a uh, What's it called? Urban Outfitters, and I'm really excited for that. I really want to go when that opens, because I'm going to be there shopping a lot. I've never shopped at that store either, but let me show you guys what I bought at Anthropology. So, I don't think I've said this before in one of my videos, but I've been studying French and learning how to speak French and read it and write it. So, I bought at Anthropology a really cute dictionary. But it's not a word dictionary, it's a phrase dictionary. What I loved about Anthropology is that they wrapped it and it looks so cute like a gift. Here's the book. Oh, this book was only, it smells so good. Uh, this book was only 
ten dollars and get this no tax like I was amazed a store that sells things with no tax I don't know if it was only the book or like the whole store but no taxes on the book and I was really really amazed really happy and yeah so here's the book and the camera will focus now okay here's focusing see it's just a French dictionary I'm really excited to study it and read it and learn some more French because I'm obsessed with French now and I want to go to France and speak to the local people there one of my dreams and yeah the book smells amazing I don't know what they put in these books but it smells really good those are all the things that I'll be showing in today's video haul uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it please give the video a thumbs up and Leave a comment down below saying what was your favorite thing that I bought. And yeah, if you want to subscribe for more videos, here is the link. And follow me in Instagram and Twitter if you want to see more of me. And the rest of my social media links are down below in the description box. I will catch you guys in next week's video with a brand new video. Yeah. Bye.